Hello there. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. And something is going on with the camera. Hold on. Hello, hello, Roxana. Can you hear me? Yes, hello. Hello. Can you there. hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. All good? Okay. All good? Yes. How, how was your day, Roxana? Um, busy, busy. It was busy? Why? Yes, in my work. Why, why? Why was it busy? Yeah, I had to make a lot of things. Okay. Uh, but we are here. Nice, Ready. nice, nice. All right. Are you yes. the same Roxana that I know? The cool Roxana uh, that I know? Uh, yes, 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 yes. All right, very good. Because <laughs> your name is kind of different now. Hello, Jose. Welcome, welcome, welcome back. Are you scared of coronavirus, Jose? <laughs> or you're good? I think that Jose isn't, uh, no, he doesn't have the microphone. Oh, he doesn't have a microphone? Okay. Uh -huh, I can see. Uh -huh. All right. All right. Um, Roxana, do you have a camera? Uh, yes, but I have a little problems with the camera. Okay. But I can see, I can see you All right. and Sounds hear you too. Sounds good. Sounds good. Sounds good. Right. Yes. Um, whenever you can try to turn it on, because it's just to make sure that people are not sleeping or, you know, <laughs> so. Uh, <laughs> you're, you're, yes. You're, hey, I'm sorry about yesterday. I had a, I had an accident just uh, at the last moment. So I'm very sorry about that. OK. Um, so but I'm glad to, to see you back. Okay. Jose, Jose, can you could you turn on your camera, bro? All right. If you can't hear me. I think, yeah, okay. his audio is probably not I think working. that he, he's, he's not on, on the microphone. Yeah, yeah, no, I, I could notice that. Hey, how was the, how was the class yesterday? Uh, nice, nice. Well, uh, we have uh, the problems at the beginning. Oh, okay, For yeah. connection, I uh have -huh, for connection, yeah, yeah. but, but. Uh, nice to meet you. I, I, I think that the teacher was, uh, oh. Are you here? Are you there? Yeah, I'm here. I'm here. Okay, I'm sorry. Yeah. yeah uh, 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 what? I'm, I'm ordering the words in my mind. <laughs> I'm sorry. Hey, your English is, is pretty good, all right? Uh, the Punisher, <laughs> right? All right, the Punisher. What's, what's going on, Punisher? <laughs> Punisher, can you say something? Well, good, they're good. How are you? Uh, Punisher, do you have a camera? My God, it's kind of hot today. All right, guys, so time to, time to get started. Hey, uh, let me ask you something. So where did you, where did you, um, where did you, uh, did, did you leave off, uh, leave off, I'm sorry. And donde, and donde se quedaron ayer? Roxana? Oh, yes. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah. Where did you live off yesterday? Uh, yesterday we we had um, right, I'm gonna share this. We we were talking about different sentences. Okay. All right. You're uh -huh, talking and... about different sentences. Uh, don't remember. <laughs> okay, all right, sounds good. Maybe sounds another good. another partner can say another thing. Are you are you okay? All right, you sound you sound familiar, but I'm trying to figure out who you are exactly. Uh, if it is the same Roxana that I know, you have improved your English, <laughs> all right? I need to improve my English. 
<laughs> yeah, but you have improved a lot. If it is the same, Roxana, that I know you have improved your English, okay? All right, Jose, Jose, can you say something, Jose? Hello. Oh, nice. There you are. Hi, right, Jose. Okay. How are you? How are you? Nice to meet you. Hi, and you? Good, good, good. All right, my name is David, guys. Uh, nice to meet you all. I'll be your um, nice I'll be instructor you for advanced, I mean, pre-advanced. Um, so we'll continue, okay? Um, guys, uh, whenever you can, do my favor. Just turn on the camera so we can make sure that nobody's sleeping. The Punisher, I want to make sure that you're not, that you're not um, punishing people, you know? <laughs> Hi. Right. <laughs> no, good, good, good. All right. How are you? How are you? Um, so, Jose, tell me about yourself. How do you uh, feel so far? Uh, do you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. I can hear. You. Yeah. Okay. No, I will change my 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 name. I will put another there. Okay. All right. What's what's your real name? Moses. Moses, nice to meet you, Moses. Moses, do you have a camera, Moses? Huh? Do you have a camera? Yes. All right, sounds good. Could you could you please turn it on? Eh, I will put my teeth here. Okay. All right. Sounds good. Sounds good. Sounds good. Okay. All right, guys. So I'm gonna share. Hello there, Jose. Hello. Nice to meet you. I have never seen you before, but nice to meet you, bro. Okay. Good. Nice to meet you too. Oh, good. Oh, good. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. <laughs> Is it hot where you're at right now? Is it hot? Sorry? Is it hot where you're at right now? No, it's cold because there are wind. Okay, because it's windy. Okay, very good, very good. Yes, it's windy. Oh my God, I got a lot of new people here. Ana, Ana Hiron, how are you? Hello, teacher. Nice to see you again. How are you? We're good? Great, teacher. Great, great. Nice to see you. Nice to see you. Uh, uh, Anna, do you have a camera? Yes. All right. So, Anna, I'm sorry for yesterday. Um, I had a small issue with my computer. Like, well, actually, it was not, it was not as, as small. Uh, Anna, there you are. There you are. There you go. Okay. Nice to see you, Anna. You're good. All right. And Raul, how are you, Raul? How are you doing? Hello. I'm pretty good. And you, how are you? I'm good. I'm good. I'm excellent. I'm, I'm really, really good. All right. Uh, Raul, uh, thank, nice, to, nice to meet you, man. Um, how's it going? How was your day? Oh, thanks for asking. My day is a little bit tired, a little bit tired, but everything is okay. I am happy to be here. My God, and your English is good, man. Uh huh. Thank you. Thank you. And let's go. <laughs> All right, sounds good, sounds good. Okay, guys, so uh, let's get started. I'm gonna go ahead and share the screen right now. And uh, you, let me, you let me know when you left off, okay? All right, let's see, let's see, let's see. All right, guys, so can you see my screen right now? Yes. All right, I'm just sending a text message to the rest of the group so can join me right now. Hold on, hold on, hold on, all right? Mm-hmm. All right, great, 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 great. Go okay. start the exercise. Yeah, no, I will try not to start it right now, okay? Um, so, where did you leave off, guys? Um, ¿Dónde se quedaron? ¿Dónde se quedaron ayer, uh, Ana? Yesterday, only meeting the group. Only... Yeah. Introduce ourselves. Introduce. Oh, okay, okay. I'm uh -huh. so sorry. <laughs> guys, uh, yeah. I apologize for yesterday for the ones who just came in. I apologize for yesterday. I had, a, I had a, actually a big issue with the computer, so it's all good. Yes. It's all good. It's all good. Nice to see you all. All right, guys, so uh, let's get started. Let's go to the beginning. All right, I okay. kind of I kinda solved some of the topics that we have today. Do you remember... Do you remember mm -hmm. the relative pronouns from the last uh, from last um, from the last um, topic that we saw? Yeah. All right. Did you do? Yes. Yeah. All right. Very good. Right. Now, Roberto. Roberto, uh, how are you, dude? All good? A fine teacher. Yes. Very good. Right, Roberto. Do you have a do you have a camera? Could you turn it down, please? Yes, give me a second. All right, turn it on and um, let's get started, okay? All right, guys, so, all right, uh, Anna. All right, help me read the first objective. Um, 
by the end of this lecture, participants will be able to use relative pronouns. Okay, very good job, very good job. All right, now pronunciation, guys. Say one, Roberto, nice to see you, brother. How are you doing? Hello. You look like a guy from the army. <laughs> <laughs> You're all ripped, right? You're all ripped. Do you know what ripped means? No? Ripped? All right. Write down if you don't know it. Okay. Ripped is like cuadrado, all right? Look all ripped, man. All right. <laughs> all right, very good. All right. So guys, very good. Pronunciation, guys. Lecture. 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 All right. The other one, all right. By the end of this lecture. By, by, the, by the end of, of this lecture. lecture. Participants will be able. Participants, participants will be able. Will be able. All right, guys. So pronunciation, it's able, okay? It's, it's able. not able, right? Able, 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 right? Very good, very good. Mm -hmm. All right. All right, continue, right? Continue. Uh, help me read, uh, Roberto. Uh, we'll be able to use relative pronouns. Who and that are subject. Very good job. Very good job, bro. Okay. All right. Let's get started then. We got to move on faster, guys, because uh, we're missing. So... Let's uh, let's just listen right now. Hold on. All right, let's go. So that was quite simple. I like to meet people. Hello, everyone. In this class, you learn how to describe the kind of people you like to hang around with. For example, I like friends who aren't too serious. You'll learn how to use the relative pronouns who or that. Now, let me get. All right, guys, let me ask you something. What relative pronouns are we going to learn how to use today? Hold on. Let me unmute you all, all right? What relative, yep. what, what relative pronouns are we going to learn how to use today? Who and that. Who and that. Who and that. Very good job. I love your listening, guys. Very good job, all right? Let's, let's keep going. Started by the structure. We'll do a few examples, and at the end of the class, I would like for you to practice by making your own examples. Let me talk about the first example that you see here, relative pronouns as subjects. So in essence, what we want to do in this class is we want to take two pieces of information. For example, I like guys. They aren't too serious. That's the second piece of information. And what we want to do is we want to combine these two pieces of information. And we do this by using the relative pronouns. Word. All right, so what do we use relative pronouns for, guys? To combine what? Uh, relative clauses. All right, all right. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Okay, relative clauses, right? Applause, guys. Applause for, for Anna. That was Anna, right? Or Roxana? Roxana. <laughs> Roxana, right? Roxana. Roxana, Anna. Kind of, <laughs> just kidding, right? Good job, good job, good job. <laughs> Almost the same. <laughs> Almost the same, right? <laughs> <laughs> you're going to use who or that to combine those two pieces of information. So at the end, what the sentence is going to look like is, I like guys who are into serious. Or you could say, I like guys that are into serious. I'm going to write down those examples to make sure that we're understanding the process. The first example states, I like guys they aren't serious. And what we do is, if you notice. Okay, so let's do something real quick, okay? Now let's use two examples. We were gonna use who and that, mm -hmm. okay? All right, so I'm gonna okay. get you groups right now, guys, and I needed to, um, to, I needed to practice with your couple using examples, joining two sentences together, okay? All right, so we're gonna join two sentences. Um, let's see, uh, Jose. Mm. All right, Jose, give me, Give me something that, um, give, give me, um, tell me about people that you like. I, um, hmm? I like people that, who are intelligent. Okay. Okay. Very, very good. Okay. So they are intelligent. Okay. All right. Very good. Okay. Uh, tell me about people that you hate, Roxana. Uh, I hate people that lies. Okay, I hate people. All right. That lie. Mm -hmm. 
they lie, 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 okay? So very lie. good, okay? Mm -hmm. So we're gonna join these two sentences together. That was, that's a little bit twist, okay? Those are example, guys, so very good job. You actually gave me the relative pronoun already. All right, so mm -hmm. you said, I like people who are intelligent, right? Okay. Yes. Right. So now, let's get some practice, guys. Give me sentences with relative pronouns using who and that, okay? All right, so I hate people who I lie, for example, right? Who, who lie. Very good, okay? So remember, what do we use uh, relative pronouns for? Mm -hmm. I like so. people who... Now, what, what do we oh, use sorry. relative pronouns for? But I can't uh, wait. When we refer to someone. Okay, we use it for yawning to, to what? To classes. To, okay, two sentences together, okay? Two, two ideas, very good job, okay. very good job, right? All right, let's get started. Now oh, somebody else is joining, all right? Who, who is, oh no, nobody? Right, never mind. All right, let's go with three participants, let's go. All right, let's join it, guys, okay? All right, Jose, you uh, are you having issues joining rooms? Sorry? Are you having issues joining rooms right now? No. No, you good? All right. You need to join one of the rooms. Okay, you need to join one of the rooms right now, okay? Okay. All right. All right I'm going to try to move you to a different room, see if you can join. All right, did you get the request? Did you get the request, Jose? There you go. Uh, according to the information in the platform, that and in, in, in who is the same function I can say we, we, we can use this the both in the same case one or another good job girls you're talking you're talking English do you have a question do you have a question so far uh, mm. uh, yeah uh, talking about the that in in who yeah yeah, yeah. If the same uh -huh, if the same use in the sentence okay you want to know if you can interchange it right Si lo uh -huh. Yeah, you can use it interchangeably, all right? But uh, who are intelligent? Y con that, ¿cómo queda? I, li uh -huh. I like people. Uh -huh. What relative pronoun do we use there, right? You uh, can who? Say, actually, all right, exactly, right? You can say who are, who are intelligent and you can use that are intelligent. That. Uh, that exactly, 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 okay? Very good, very good. Okay. Keep on practicing, okay? Talk, 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 talk like crazy. Okay. <laughs> I'll be right back. <laughs> Hello, guys. How's it going? Right? Are you talking in English? Yes. yes all right. Practicing. Good job, good job. All right, so give me examples right now. Let me hear you. Roberto. Yeah. I, I like people who love or go to cinema. Okay. Ah, uh -huh. let's see, uh, Raul. Uh, my last example uh, was I don't like people who listen reggaeton music. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> what about? Okay, give me uh, give me another example. Give me another example. Oh my God, that's good. That's crazy. That's crazy. Okay, what else? What else? What other type of people you don't like? Uh huh. Only only that kind of, of people. Only that kind of people. Okay, very yeah. good. All right. Give me more examples. Okay, you gotta talk, guys. You gotta talk. Okay. All right. Good I, job, like, good job. I like people who loves the nature, camping, and what do you want to? To say. Or, uh, 
Vai, hipócrita meu foi mentiroso. Hipócrita. Hipócrita. Oh, yeah. no... Hipócrita? É... Hello, Roberto. <laughs> uh, how do you say, how do you say hipócrita? Okay, pronunciation. Jose, what is the right pronunciation? Hipócrita. Não. Hipócrita. Okay. Are you sure? Are you sure? 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 <laughs> Okay, pronunciation is hypocrite. Hello, Irene. Nice to see you again. How are you doing? All good? Great, great, great. Great, All right. Nice to see you. Nice to see you. I didn't know that I was going to see you here again. All right. Good to see you. Good to see you back. All right. Come on in. Just start uh, start uh, talking. All right. Let's get some practice. Okay. Very good. Very good. Okay. All right, guys. So let's head back so we can continue. Okay. Good job, guys. Good job. All right. Okay. We are here. All right, there you go, there you go, there you go, there you go. All right, guys, so let's get moving, okay? Okay. Uh, Anna, pick someone, pick someone, Anna. Someone, pick someone, uh, pick someone beautiful. <laughs> Beautiful, Elisa. All right, let's go, Elisa. Hello, Elisa. How are you doing? All good. I'm fine. All right, good job, good job. Thank you for joining. All right, let's let's go. Okay. So, Elisa, can you help me read the uh, the objective, please? Okay. By the end of the lecture, participants will be able to use relative pronouns, who and that, as object. Okay. Very good job. Okay. All right, guys, how do you pronounce this in red, okay? How do you pronounce this? Actually, I, I'm just pronouncing it right now, okay? Everyone, this. Of oh, this, this. Everyone, this. 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 It's a very this. short this. I, okay? Of very this. this. All right, so we're gonna use, we're gonna learn how to use, what? Relative well, pronouns, who cool and that. Very good job, very good job, all right? So let's get started, all right? Okay, so do me a favor, guys. Grab your notebook. Do you have a notebook with you? Yeah. Then, yes, uh, I have. Grab your notebook and um, and uh, write down vocabulary, things that you, uh, new things that you learn. Uh, write down the structure. I know, guys. I know that you can see the structure on the screen. However, you know, um, if you write something down, you know, your brain is connected to your hand, right? So it is actually easier for you to memorize things. If you write things down, did you know that? If you okay. didn't, now you don't, okay? All right, let's go. Three, two, one, go. Or by using that. So in this class, you learn how to describe the kind of people you like to hang around with. All right, what are we gonna, what are we gonna learn in this class? Um. All right, um, Anna. Uh, I, I'm, you're the only one that I can see, All right? Uh, what's your favorite color, Anna? It's green. Green? Okay, All right. Green, 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 green. All right. Roberto, your eyes are kind of green, okay? Let's go. <laughs> so tell me, what are we going to learn in this lesson? I can hear uh, clear. Uh, your eyes are kind of green. So, what are we going to learn in this lesson? By Hello, everyone. In this class, you learn how to describe the kind of people you like to hang around with. All right, what is it? What did he say? Uh huh. What kind of people? I don't know. Okay. <laughs> All right, guys, listen, listen, listen. Okay, All right, let's go section by section. Okay. Hello, everyone. In this class, you learn how to describe the kind of people you like to hang around with. All right, got it, got it, got it. Have the kind of people. people. Right. Okay, this is why he said, okay, all right. The kind, everyone, the kind, the kind, the kind, the kind. Of, people of people you like right. to hang around hang with. Everyone, around the with. kind of people you like to hang around with. All right, all right, let's repeat, guys. The kind of people that you like to hang around with. To hang around the with. The kind of people. 
or you like to hang the around? The kind of people you like to hang around. around. All right, phrasal verb, guys. What is hang around? Hang around. I don't know. All right, people hang around is that, uh, vacilar, all right? Like, uh, uh, ¿quieres vacilar con...? Like go, like go out with, with friends. Exactly, exactly. Like going out mm. with friends. Very good job, right? Clap, clap, clap. Go there, right? Good, good, good. Clap right. again. Right. <laughs> right. Come on, guys. What is that? Energy, <laughs> right? All right, very good, guys. All right, let's finish this video, okay? For example, I like friends who aren't too serious. You'll learn how to use the relative pronouns who or that. Now, let me get started by presenting the structure. We'll do a few examples, and at the end of the class, I would like for you to practice by making your own examples. Let me talk about the first example that you see here, relative pronouns as subjects. So, in essence, what we want to do in this class is we want to take two pieces of information. For example, I like guys. They are into serious. That's the second piece of information. And what we want to do is we want to combine these two pieces of information. And we do this by using the relative pronouns. We're either going to use who or that to combine those two pieces of information. So at the end, what the sentence is going to look like is, I like guys who are into serious. Or you can say, I like guys that are into serious. I'm going to write down those examples to make sure that we're understanding the process. All right, guys. So this is pretty much what, we, what um, your practice just now. So uh, we're going to skip that for a moment, okay? All right, guys, do you have any question right now about uh, relative pronouns using who and that? ¿Tienen alguna pregunta acerca de los uh, relative pronouns that we have seen so far? Who and that? No. All right, let me ask you something, okay? Can we um, use them both? Can we use them both to mean the same thing? We can use the... We can use both, but not at the same time. Okay, why not? If I say, I like guys who are into series, and I like guys that are into series, is that, is that not the same thing, or is it? Uh, uh, yeah, it's the same thing. Okay, very good job, very good job. It, it is, actually, it is, okay? All right. Very good, guys, very good, okay? All right, guys, so I uh, don't look, look, look at the answers. <laughs> All right, so let's continue with the video. I'm going to write down those examples to make sure that we're understanding the process. The first example states, I like guys, they are into serious. And what we do is, if you notice in grade up here, and I actually colored that in blue in the bottom because that's what I want to focus on. Um, here, this statement here could vary, it could change to different things, right? Like you can say, I like guys, I like friends. Okay, I like people. So that could vary. You could change that to whatever you want. You can have another phrase there, like I uh, like to hang around people. I like to be with friends, etc. That phrase could change, not just necessarily I like guys. And then they aren't too serious. Um, in this case, I want you to notice that we're using adjectives. All right. So whenever you use adjectives. What you're going to have in this uh, second statement is going to be. Okay, guys. So what are we using in this, in this example? What is serious? What is serious in, in grammar? Adjective. Very good job. Very good job. All right. Good job. Good job. Good job. Um, the verb to be either positive or negative. Okay. Um, and, then the, and then that's going to follow the adjective. And so what I want you to notice at this time is how we take these two pieces of information and we combine them together with the usage of the relative pronouns who or that. So let me give that example now. I like guys who aren't too serious. I like guys that aren't too serious. Now, what I want to explain here is that you can either use the relative pronoun who or you can use the relative pronoun that.
And also what I want you to notice is that in um, this statement, so they will disappear. The pronoun here is they that disappear. And we changed it to they uh, to and we changed it to who or we changed it to that. Okay, so I like guys who are into Sears. This is on our first example. Let me talk about the second example now. Yeah. And the reason this one. Oh, we're not going to go further into this because it's pretty much what we saw, okay? It's um, uh, pretty much it's telling us that we can interchange, you know, who or that, okay? And uh, the examples that you gave me, guys, they were absolutely perfect, okay? All right, so let's see who can answer the following <laughs> exercises, okay? All right. You can cheat, okay? You can take a look at the first two that we got here, but I need you to complete the rest, okay? So work in teams, guys, and let's go ahead and solve uh, exercise 1.4 in the platform, okay? You guys ready? Yes or yes? Yes. You good? All right, very good, very good, very good, okay? Let's do it, let's do it, okay? You got exactly uh, five minutes to finish this up, okay? All right, let's go. One point three is the video. Uh, One point four. You have a are you yes, ready? Sir. Yes. The first eh, una pregunta. Entonces mm -hmm. Bueno, no la sé decir en inglés, pero este, vamos a, a escoger la mejor oración, pero eh, ¿cómo es? Este, no sé, hay okay. alguna, alguna regla. All right, do you know what the meaning of matches is? Matches? <laughs> huh? uh, can you read me the instructions? Can you read the instructions for me? Select the best clause that matches. That statement. Very good job, right? What is the meaning of matches, Anna? It's uh, similar. Very Convenient. good job. Okay, it's like um, that igual, right? Igual a la oración, mm -hmm. okay? So you have to, yeah, exactly, you have to choose something that is similar, all right? Mm -hmm. All right? So, for example, the first example, right? I don't want a partner. Maybe you know that you have nothing in common with this person, all right? The second example, right? I'd like to meet people who have a good sense of humor, for example, okay? All right, so think about it, okay? So choose the one that, that best matches the, the, the sentence, okay? Tienen que elegir la una la que se... La que se... Exactly, right? O sea, se tiene que parecer al que nota de ejemplo. Exactly, exactly. Now, no Spanish, all right? Okay. <laughs> you're, you're advanced, so no Spanish, okay? All right, good job, good job. All right, I'm going to check on the other rooms. I'll be right back. Bye, teacher. Yeah. My God, where's the big rooms? Okay. How are you doing, guys? How are you doing? Yes. Have, having issues? All good? They're good? Oh, good, or you have any issues? Everything is okay. It's okay? Okay, very good, very good, very good. Okay. I don't like people who drive with, like, aggressive because it's dangerous. I don't like people who... I don't like who... I don't like people who are... A strong or weak? Sorry, sorry. A strong or weak? 
in the opposite side of a strong oh yeah yeah it's okay it's the okay. opposite side or the opposite the opposite very good job, very good job. okay all right good job good job guys okay, okay. Right, continue guys continue okay okay uh, i like friends who love who love pets How's it going, guys? All good? Having issues, Irene? All good? All good? All right, good, 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 good. Todo bien? No, no questions so far, Jose, Roberto? I have a question, only one question. Okay, ask me. In the last one, in the last one, teacher. The last one? In the last one, I have, I don't like, I don't like. Uh -huh. The answer is is bad. Maybe I have a mistake, but can you? Okay, I'll help you when we go back. Right now, ask Jose and ask Roberto. Okay, actually, uh, let me give you a tip. Take a look at the example, and the example will give you the answer. Okay, guys, Jose, what do you have to okay. do? What do you have to do, Jose? Uh, read the uh, read and check the the answer that is good or or bad. Okay, you have to take a look. No, no, no. Read the example, okay? What is the example? Mm -hmm. Roxana, uh, actually, you know what? Roberto, Roberto, can you read me? Uh, can you read the example for me, please? Uh, example, the number one, or anywhere. Example, the, the one that says I example. I don't want to have. Exactly. I don't, I don't want to have partner. Partner. Very good job, very good job. But read it all. Read the whole example. I don't want to have partner. I have nothing in common with this person. Okay, okay, no, but okay, but read below that, okay? Just underneath. I don't want to have a partner who. Roberto? I don't like, excuse me, I don't, I don't want to have a partner. Um, who I have nothing in common with this person. Okay, you're almost there, you're almost there, okay? Take a look at the example, okay? All right, let's head back and uh, we'll get into that, okay? All right, let's see, let's see. I'm gonna close all the rooms right now, hold on. Hi, teacher. What's up, people? <laughs> good, good, good. Are you having issues? A little bit difficult? No? A little bit. <laughs> a little bit, a little bit. All right. A little, a little bit issues. All right. Oh, yeah. It happens. It happens. Okay. All right, guys. So, who finished? Who finished them all? Que nos terminó absolutamente todos. Nobody? Okay. All right. All right. Let's start with um, Irene. Irene, um, what's the what's the answer for number one? Have not in informal common with this person. Very good job. Okay, good job. Did you did you hear that, guys? No. Okay. What is it, Irene? What is it? What is the answer? I have not in informal with this person. Very good job. Okay, number two, Elisa. Uh, these people have. A good sense of humor. Very good job, okay. Uh, number three, uh, Anna. Mm. I don't have a bad, um, maybe is this person is quiet and considerate. Beautiful job, all right. Roberto, Roberto, my brother from another mother. What's number four? I don't feel comfortable. Comfortable. All right, comfortable. comfortable, guys. Comfort. Mesa. All right. Comfortable. 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 Yeah. comfortable. All right. Or you can say, if you, actually, if you say comfortable. comfortable, comfortable, it's also okay, right? But uh, people usually say comfortable, okay? Comfortable. Very good job. Very good job. All right. One more time, Roberto. Give me a second. Number. Number. number I don't four. feel. I don't feel comfortable. Comfort. No, I don't know. Com comfortable. 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 Okay. I don't feel comfortable, comfortable. around these people. All right, comfortable. comfortable. All right, we're good. You gotta practice that. You gotta practice that. Okay. You need more practice. Yes. Good job. Good job. Good job. All right. Number five, uh, Raúl. Okay. 
these people are war, um, sensitive. Beautiful job, beautiful job. Number six, uh, Roxana. I am sorry, I don't have in front of me the sentences, so I can't read. <laughs> Okay, all right. Sorry, okay, very good, very sorry, good. sorry. I'll share the screen with you then. Ooh. There we go, there we go, okay. Number uh, number six, number six. I, uh, number six, I'd rather have a pose. Okay, everyone, I'd rather. I'd rather. Everyone, uh, I'd. I'd. I'd, I'd say, rather. Say, say Aida. Everyone, Aida. Aida. All right, I'd. I I'd. I'd. I'd very good job. I'd uh, so. rather have a boss. Beautiful job. I'd rather this have a boss. This person has a good leadership qualities. Beautiful job, beautiful job, right? Number seven, number seven, uh, Jose. Mm -hmm. What's I'd. number seven? Jose? Jose. All right, Moses, what's number seven? I prefer to have teacher. These people are organized and intelligent. Oh, wow. Beautiful job. What is the pronunciation? Roxana, one more time. These people are organized and intelligent. Beautiful job. How do you pronounce it? Um, these people? Moses. Moses, how do you pronounce it? Oh, sorry, sorry. <laughs> people are organized. And intelligent. Beautiful job, beautiful job, beautiful job. All right. Oh, I'm, I don't want to give you the answer for number two, right? Now, guys, number two, okay? Whoever has the answer for number two, I'll call Pizza Hut and ask you for a pizza, okay? <laughs> Good. <laughs> but only if you have it, only if you have it, okay? So, all right, so tell me, all right, volunteer, who has it? Who has it? Who has the right uh, answer? Roberto? Yes, I got it. What is the right answer? <laughs> Yes, uh, the answer the, um, is I don't like to be with people who I have nothing in common with. Beautiful job. Okay, beautiful job, okay, beautiful job. Beautiful job okay? okay. Applause for Roberto, guys. Super, super good job, okay? Very good, very good, very good, all right? Super good, all right? So, guys, I like to meet people. No, okay, that's number two. What, what's uh, the answer for number one? It's to be in the example, teacher. <laughs> All right, guys. So these are the two answers, okay? The first one, everyone, I'd like to meet people. Everyone, repeat. I'd like to meet Who have people. a good sense. Okay. Who have a good sense. Everyone, repeat, guys. I'd like to meet people who have okay. a good sense of humor with fluency. Let's go, okay? Let me hear you, Irene. Five, four, three, two, one. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Irene. 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 All right, read number one, okay? Read the answer for number one with fluency. Okay. Uh, too slow, Elisa. Let's go, let's go, let's go, Elisa. Which one? Number what? one, number one. The answer for number one. I, I like to meet people who, who have a good sentence of humor. Okay, who have, guys, or who has? Who have. Um, okay, uh, are you sure? Are you sure? Who have, okay, very good. People is, plural, people is? Plural. Plural, very good job, very good job, okay. Anna, example number two, fluency, let's go. Three, two, one, go. I don't like to be with people. Uh-huh, uh with people what? What is the relative clause that we use that, there? Who? Uh -huh. Who have, who have nothing. Who I have nothing in common. Very good job. Oh, my God. All right. Hey, we got a new teacher here. Who was that? Elisa or that was Roxana? Roxana, right? <laughs> All right. Hey, we got a new teacher, Roxana, right? Roxana, what is the answer? I don't like to be with people who I have nothing in common with. Beautiful job. Beautiful job. All right. All right. I don't like to be with people. I have nothing in common nothing with, okay? Common with. Guys, remember remember to get the periods at the end, okay? Pongan el puntito al final, okay? All right, good job. Quiero, right. Decir algún, quiero decir algo en español con respecto a estos ejercicios. Tell me, tell me, tell me. Uh, I was rewriting the sentences, but always were, uh, were wrong, and I don't know why, if for the period of the punctuation or the ap ap apostrophe. 
do you have it I wrong? <laughs> do you have it wrong there? It's okay, it's okay. Do you have it wrong there right now? Ahorita, like, is it is it wrong right now? Or is it okay? Yo re, o sea, no dijiste, Spanish, la, la, no Spanish, no Spanish. I'm sorry. Rewrite the sentences, but I don't know if I write in in a incorrect way. But I I, I was checking and I am sure that this is the correct way. Mm -hmm. But when I I'll do something right now. In in, in both. And I don't know if, it, if, the, if the if if the period at the end or in the apostrophe right. or I don't know. Okay, all right. So I'm sorry or to the cut construction. you. I'm sorry to cut you short. Um, guys, by the way, cut you short. They want cut you short. Cut you short. Cut you short, okay? That means cut interrumpir, short. all right? Interrumpir, all right? Oh, okay, 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 okay. Right then, okay? I'm sorry to cut you short. Um, I sent I sent the answers right now to the to the chat group, okay? To the, to the oh, chat okay, group, okay? okay. All right? Mm -hmm, okay. So you can notice there. So sometimes what happens is that you're going to have a dot uh, period at the end, and sometimes you have to use contractions. So if you don't, if you don't use them, mm -hmm. you know, um, it won't, uh, the answers won't be taken. So that's pretty much it. Okay. So, uh, let's go with the next one. Okay. All right. Let's take a listen guys. And, uh, any questions, let me know. Okay. Okay. Hold your horses. Hold on. By the way, that's another one guys. That's another one. Let me write it down. Okay. Hold your horses. Okay. Hold your horses means Hold your horses. relax the muffin, okay? Relaja el queque. <laughs> it means okay. to wait, guys, to hold on, okay? <laughs> All right. A temperamental person is someone who has... Hi, everyone. By the end of this class, you'll learn adjectives that describe personal characteristics. And you'll listen to an audio program in which you'll identify the adjectives that best describe each individual. So let's get started by learning the adjectives that you see before you. I'll be making this document available so you can have it for reference. Easygoing. An easygoing person is someone who doesn't worry much or get angry easily. Egotistical. An egotistical person is someone who has a very high opinion of himself or herself. Inflexible. An inflexible person is someone who doesn't change easily and is stubborn. Modest. A modest person is someone who doesn't brag about his or her accomplishments. Sociable. A sociable person is someone who enjoys being... Guys, do me a favor. I, um, remember that... Um... You need to learn this, so try to write down, okay? I know that you can see it in the, uh, on the platform, but I need you to write it down, okay? Write things down so you can memorize them, okay? And welcome, Wendy. Nice to see you again. How are you doing? Do you have a camera? Can you turn it on? <laughs> oh, there you are. There you are, Wendy. All good? What's, uh, what's cracking? <laughs> all right, let's, let's continue, guys. Let's move on, all right? Okay. Being with other people. Stingy. A stingy person is someone who doesn't like sharing. Supportive. A supportive person is someone who is helpful and encouraging. Temperamental. A temperamental person is someone who has unpredictable or irregular moods. Unreliable. An unreliable person is someone who doesn't do what he or she promised. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to listen to an audio program at this time and as I mentioned we need to be familiar with these adjectives in order for us to answer the questions from this audio program. What we're going to do in this audio program is we're going to listen to a description of Andrea, James, and Mr. Johnson. And then what I would like for you to do is to choose the best statement that describes each individual so let's listen to that so I need a uh, uh, Wendy 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 right what's uh, what's your favorite food you're muted you're muted you're muted my favorite fruit uh -huh. uh, um, quickly quickly five four three two one too slow apple? Anna. Apples, okay, very good, right? Roxana, do you like apples? Yes, I like. 
Very good. Me too. So, so read, okay? You're my volunteer. <laughs> okay. Go. Me too. All right, so, so I'm sorry, not, not reading. I mean, uh, tell me what are the instructions? Uh, I read. No, 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 no. I'm sorry. What are the instructions? What did he say that we're going to do right now? He said, what I'd like you to do is, right? So what is it? Uh, I like to do, I don't know. Yeah. Okay, very good. <laughs> I'm right, sorry. Let's, all right, let's listen, I'm guys. <laughs> all right, all right. Don't, don't, don't worry, okay? It's okay, it's okay. James and Mr. Johnson. And then what I would like for you to do is to choose the best statement that describes each individual. So let's listen to that audio program at this time. So, have you seen Andrea lately? Yeah, I okay, see. What are the instructions? To the audio program at this time. The best statement that describes each individual. So what is it? It went the best statement. Other statement, right? That describes. That describes each individual. The person. All right. All right. So that's what we're gonna do. So let's listen to that audio program at this time. So, have you seen Andrea lately? Yeah, I see her once in a while. How's she doing? I've been meaning to call her. Well, to be honest, she's kind of been getting on my nerves lately. What do you mean? She's changed a lot since we've started college. She talks about herself all the time, and she always manages to mention how good she is at everything she does. Really? That would be annoying. It is. You know, she asked me to be roommates with her next semester, but I don't think I want to live with her. She used to be really generous, but now she's just the opposite. And it's not just with money, but her time as well. Well, college can be stressful. You two are good friends. Maybe you need to talk more. Hi hey guys, all right, so are you ready to cry? <laughs> because you're going to have to solve an exercise, which is kind of difficult next. So <laughs> I hope you paid attention, okay? All right, you can go back in your own, on your own platform, guys, okay? Let's continue. Are you going to James's party on Saturday? Of course. James always gives the best parties, and there are always lots of interesting new people to meet. It's true. I don't know where he manages to find them all. Well, you know what he's like. He makes friends very easily. He really likes talking to people, and he loves inviting people over. Uh-huh. He invited me for dinner last Saturday. What a feast. Yeah, he's a great cook, too. After dinner, I offered to help clean up, and he told me not to worry about it. He said he'd take care of it later. He was like, it's nothing, no big deal. Yep, that sounds like James. Very good job, guys. Did you Have you met the new apartment manager? Mr. Johnson? Yeah, I met him last week. He's a little strange. Yeah, he is. I'm not sure I like him. He's hard to predict. Sometimes he's pretty cheerful and talkative, and the next day he doesn't even say hello. I think he must have personal problems or something. I think you're right. And have you noticed that half the time when he says he's going to do something, he never actually does it? He told me three times he'd come to fix the light in my kitchen, and he still hasn't done it. All right, great job, guys. So let's get started, okay? So let's get in group, guys, and you're going to solve the following the next exercise is alone, okay? <laughs> Good luck. All right, guys, now, if you have any questions, uh, let me know, okay? Don't look, don't look at the screen because you're cheating. All right. Hold on. Hold your horses. All right, guys, let's work on the 1.7 exercise, okay?
Jose, Jose, can you hear me, brother? Um, can you um, can you join a room, or are you having issues joining a room right now? No, I, I can. I have a problem with the with the audio, and I can hear it very well. But okay. I'm trying to to enter to the platform. To the platform. Okay, okay. So you're having issues <laughs> joining the platform right now. Got you, bro. Got yes. you. Yes. Okay. All right. Let me know when when it's over, dude. Um, once you join the platform, um, hit me up so I can so I can get you inside one of the rooms. Okay. Okay. Good job. Good job. Good job. Right now, if you're doing this, <laughs> bummer. You're gonna have to <laughs> you're gonna have to solve it alone. Okay. Tienes que resolverlo solito ahorita, right? I'm gonna help okay, you with no. the answers later on, all right? But good job, good job, good job. I'm gonna check on the rooms right now. So work on the platform. Okay. Hello there. Hello. All right. It's gonna be kind of difficult if um, you didn't take notes. So uh, let's uh, let me know if you have any question. Okay. Talk, okay. talk, guys. I need you talking, okay? I need you like, hey, what do you think the answer for this is, okay? Talk, 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 talk. Okay. Okay. And Andrea is uh, egoistical and stingy. Yeah. All right. Okay. Yes, it's okay. And then... Yes. Hey, easy going. Yes, so how are you doing guys? Oh look at you, you have cameras. Nice, nice to see that. <laughs> yes, teacher, we do it. How are you doing? You did it already? Did you finish? Did you did you finish? Yes, teacher. Yes, you did? You did alright. Talk then, because not everyone is done, okay? So let's let's talk right now. Talk, talk, talk in English, of course. Alright, uh Chambria cerca like I don't know, like if you saw your best friend with, with his other couple, with his other girl, just talk about that, okay? <laughs> I don't know, whatever you want, right? Talk to them. I'm going to check on the other rooms. So I'll be right back with you, okay? Good job, guys. Okay. Good job. Good job. Okay. Okay, talk about the best friend. Okay. Mm, describe your best friend, correct? Very good job. <laughs> <laughs> talk, man. All right. Talk. You know what? You know what? Talk about your crushes. Do you know what a crush is? No. Crush to crush is like uh, Scarlett Johansson, right? Scarlett Johansson is my crush. Uh, crush. Got it? it like someone, someone you really, really like. I didn't uh, but you cannot have her. I will have him, yeah. right? Yes. All right. All right, very good. Talk, 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 talk. Then, Robert, what do you like? Now, what do you like? What do you like? Who? Guys, who? Okay. Who wrote? Uh, Explosive. Who do you like? Uh, it's, 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 it's kind of... Hello. I, Let's see. Ha, hi, teacher. You having issues? Are you having issues? Are you good? Are you okay? We oh, finished. Finish. You finished? Oh, my God. All right. Very good. Very good. Okay. Now... I need you to talk about your crushes. Do you know what crushes are? Yes. No? Yes. <laughs> all right, all right. Nah, just kidding, girls. All right, I'm gonna and and Tony. I'm right? sorry, you were here. Okay. Uh, let's head back to the. Let's go back to the main screen. All right. <laughs> Exponiendo infieles. Right. Nah, nah, nah. Just <laughs> no, teacher. No, teacher. <laughs> Not here, right? Not here. <laughs> no. All right. Okay. Good, good, good. A question. Tell me. Uh, what people. is the right way to to say egotistical? Egotistical. To pronounce. Egotistical. 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 Yes, exactly. Egotistical. Yeah, like egotistical. my ego, I have a, I have a huge uh -huh. ego, you know? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's different to say selfish. Is it different? Okay, pronounce it. Is it? It's different. No, no, no. The meaning. The meaning. The meaning. Now repeat, repeat. All right, no, la, la pregunta tiene que ser así. Is it different? Say, is it different? Ah, is it different? Then it different? saying, then saying. Selfish. Then saying. Say selfish, all right? Is it different than saying selfish? Ah, okay. Right. Um, you know, it's, it's, uh, it's, it's actually the same. It's actually the same, okay? Similar. Selfish, 
it's 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 i think it's the same actually okay all right okay. um so mm -hmm. selfish is like like yeah physical too <laughs> so it is most useful yes exactly most well useful. it's actually right let's go all right so let's head back most to the, um, let's let's head back to the main screen guys because it's time Picture, though. We don't you listen. Mute. You are mute. There you go. There you go. Okay, I'm sorry. I always forget. Hey, uh, did you get the answer for all of them three? Yeah. You did? Very good, very good, very good. Okay. Yes. All right. So if you don't have it, guys, it's it's pretty much like this, okay? All right. Uh let me take share the screen. All right. So you got the answers on the screen, guys. All right, so let's submit. Oh, I changed that. Uh, what is the answer for the first one? What is the answer for the first one, guys? Very good, very good second job, one. okay? Very good job. I don't know what happened to my answer before that. All right, guys, so now, uh, 1.7, this is where we're gonna, where, where we're gonna um, uh, leave off right now. Okay, uh, tomorrow, guys, by the way, leave off is quedarse, guys, okay? Leave off, okay? Aquí, guys, all right, so I'm going to say this in Spanish, okay? Aquí les he dejado algunas frases that are very important for you to learn, okay? So when I ask you, hey, donde, donde nos quedamos, right, is where did we leave off, okay? Leave off is donde te quedas. Got it? Got it? Got it, got it? Okay. Got it. Very good, okay. Got all right, guys, so I got, a, I got another class coming Coming up right now. Tengo otra clase ahorita, prácticamente. Uh, guys, it's been wonderful to see you again. Like, uh, Wendy. Wendy, nice to see you again. All right. Very Thank good. Thank you. You look a little bit thinner, right? All right. Uh, nice to see you, Roberto, <laughs> Irene, Elisa. Nice to meet you guys. Anna, nice to see you. Nice to see you. Roxana, very good job. Thank you for joining us. Raul, all right. Moses, nice to see you, bro. Jose just left, okay. Uh, guys, mañana, like tomorrow, uh, let's try to be early because we got to move on faster. Que tenemos que adelantarnos un poquito because of what happened on what happened yesterday, okay? Okay. okay. Applause for right. we, teacher. Applause for what? Applause for what? For we. For, uh, applause, applause for us. For all. Applause for oh. us. And applause oh. for us. Okay, very good, very good. Ah, there you go, there you go. Applause for all. All right, guys. <laughs> See you tomorrow. Thank you. See you tomorrow. Okay, Take bye. Care. Bye. 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 Have a good night. Thank you.